Okay, I just got this StarTech um, external notebook cool cooler. It's USB powered. It's two speed. I just wanted to show this, see if it's a good buy or not. And my findings, it doesn't really do much. Kind of cool to have on your laptop. Right here, I use this disc attached into this vent. On my laptop's the Gateway Peace FX series. So it doesn't go on fit on the GPU vent because the slots are slanted. But on this CPU vent, right back here, it, you just push in this button and it sits there, tighten this. And it just sits there. And you just plug it into a USB port. It is on. That's on low. And that's high. And you could change the vent. The vent's blowing this way. You can spin it around. All the way to there so the vent's blowing this way now. kind of sits there. You can feel hot air come out of it, but when you do a temperature test with, I'm going to unplug it right now. You do a temperature test with, while doing prime, while doing ore froze, it doesn't really make it any cooler. So I'm going to just start a stress test now. The CPU quickly goes in like 42 or something. Now oh, it's 46 C, 47. The max I've got since and this is on voltage too. The max I've got is probably 52 degrees I think, but it usually stays around 50, 48, depending how hot my room gets. 48 right now I'm sorry for the phone um, so 48 50 let's peak to 50 now I'm gonna plug this in 50 on one core and uh, 50 on the other, it's 50 on both, so I'm gonna plug this in. One core at the 48, back up to 50. You can feel hot air coming out of it, but it doesn't show anything on temperature of actually lowering the temps. What I have found is when I turn it off, it goes automatically from 50, 45, 44, 43. It drops a lot faster with the fan on. I start it back up. Let it go up to 50 again. I would say 47. It's 48 now. Stop it. It drops a little bit slower. Now it's at 44, 42. And that's pretty much it doesn't do much just to have a red fan on the back of your laptop. I think I bought it for $20, which is probably a waste of money. I'm going to probably pay more than $5. But since I have my laptop tilted up with this thing on the back, it doesn't really do much because I already have airflow from the vents being lifted. If I have found if I put the laptop flat, it does drop the temperature by, I think, 4 or 5 degrees Celsius if your laptop is flat. But otherwise, if it's lifted off, like, elevated, it's not going to really do anything at all. It's pretty much the StarTech cooler.
Got it off Newegg, 20 bucks. Probably wouldn't recommend getting it. Hmm, that's about it.